Trip Weather Forecast is an extension for WP Travel Engine plugin to add a weather forecast widget to the desired trips. This extension allows users to select their preferred weather location from around 800,000 locations around the globe. The widget displays weather conditions like current temperature, feels like temperature, wind, humidity, pressure, and UV index along with the sunrise sunset time for the location. It also supports hourly forecast and daily forecast along with the weather condition icons. Hello and welcome back to WP Travel Engine YouTube channel. In this video, I will walk you through the step-by-step -step installation process and setup guide of the Trip Weather Forecast add-on plugin. Let's get started. First, you need to log in to your WordPress admin dashboard. Now, navigate to Plugins and click on Add New. Click on Upload Plugin. Click on Choose File. Select the zip file that you downloaded. Then, click on Open. Click on Install Now and click on Activate Plugin. The WP Travel Engine Trip Weather Forecast add-on has now been successfully installed and activated. Next up, I will show you how you can set up and use the Trip Weather Forecast add-on on your website. First, you need to navigate to WP Travel Engine, then click on Plugin License. Enter the license key that you received during the download of the add-on. Your license key looks something like this. Click on Save Changes. Now click on Activate License. Your license key for Trip Weather Forecast add-on is activated on this side. Now let's start with the configuration process. You have to go to Appearance, then click on Widgets. Look out for the Trip Weather Forecast widget. Here it is. To display the Trip Weather Forecast on your single trips, you have to activate the widget on the WB Travel Engine sidebar. Just click on the widget. Now from the list here, you have to select WB Travel Engine sidebar. It is already selected in default so you don't have to do anything. Now simply click on Add Widget. Start by adding in the title. I'm going to add the Trip Weather Forecast as the title. You can add in header if you wish to. I'm going to skip adding the header. Then you have a bunch of options like setting the unit in Celsius or Fahrenheit. Let's select Celsius. I'm going with the default language that is English. Then you can select or unselect from two of these options. You can hide or show the sunrise or sunset time and hide or show the fields like wind, humidity, pressure and UV index information. I'm going to leave these sections checked in. Then you can also set the hourly forecast. You can either choose to hide it or you can select the number of hours to show the hourly forecast. I'm going to leave it as it is. Then you can select the daily forecast and select from the number of days or just like the hourly forecast, you can also hide the daily forecast. So let's select three days. Now after you are done, click on save and click on done. Now to configure the trip weather configuration meta box, you have to go to the individual trip post. So let's go to Trips and click on All Trips. Let's select the first trip. I will also open this trip in the new tab so that you will be able to see the differences in the end. Let's go back and we will open the first trip. From your right hand side, scroll down. And here you will see the trip weather configuration. Here, you have to type the name of the location and select the location name from the drop-down. So, let's set the location city as Paris. 
then you have to select from the list of available drop down options. Please note that you have to select the location only from the drop down option available as the widget doesn't yet support the locations that do not appear in the drop down yet. So I'm going to go with the third option Paris, France. If you want to disable or hide the weather widget, you can check the hide option here. Now we will click on update. Let's go to the front end and we will give it a refresh. And here is your trip weather forecast on the sidebar on your single trip page. Trip weather forecast displays the widget in the single trip posts based on the configured settings and preferred location. If you have any questions or queries, please do let me know in the comment section below or you can directly reach out to our support team. I have added the link to creating support ticket in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in our next video.